Hello everyone, this is Aeon Mark 3 and I'm starting a new Let's Play today on Mass Effect 3. Similarity of numbers notwithstanding, I am not actually responsible for developing this game. It's just a bit of a coincidence, which I'll probably run into every time I play the third game of a trilogy or series. Which actually sounds like a bit of fun, to be honest. Now, I have played this a little bit, or tried to, but I have not got very far at all. Most of the time on this so far has been spent in the multiplayer, mostly regaining familiarity with the controls, since I haven't touched Mass Effect 2 in quite some time. Mm. Yes, you can load already. <laughs> it does seem to take a while to scan the saves, this thing. I know I've only got <coughs> sorry. I know I've only got two saves anyway, so which was more recent? This one. Yep, this is the one where I saved everybody. Back to our queen, rescue Caden, save the council, save data. Kept Rex, hmm. and apparently I went with Jacob in Mass Effect 2. Yeah, th this is a nice touch, I think. Well, the loading screens in Mass Effect 2 were nice. I do like high-tech menus and things like that. I actually find this one a very nice spectacle. Cannot successfully determine the custom face code. If I remember right, Mass Effect 2 didn't use a save code. I don't remember the hair being like that, but it, it was just a mostly stock face with a new haircut, so I'm just going to go with that. And as usual, I will go with the Infiltrator. Tavana. Yep, let's go with that one. Now this is a loading screen I don't like as much, just looking at the terminals. I much preferred the animated ones, which were found in Mass Effect 2. Luckily that one was only quite brief. I will say that much for it. But for now, it seems there is the intro cutscene. So I don't want to be talking over this and I'll shut up. How bad is it? Bad. We just lost contact with two of our deep space outposts. There's something massive on long range scanners. Is this what Shepard warned us about? I'd stake my life on it. How long do we have? Not long. I sent word. The fleets are mobilizing. God help us all. That was a lot of ships. But... Somehow I don't think it's going to be enough. Leads the galaxy paralyzed by indecision, unable to accept the legend of the Reapers. Yeah, I think that pretty much describes it. Commander. You're not supposed to call me that anymore, James. Not supposed to salute you either. We gotta go. The defense committee wants to see you. Sounds important. What's going on? Couldn't say. Just told me they needed you. Now. Anderson? Admiral? You look good, Shepard. Maybe a little soft around the edges. How are you holding up since being relieved from duty? 
It's not so bad once you get used to the hot food and soft beds. We'll get it sorted out. What's going on? Why is everyone in such a hurry? Admiral Hackett's mobilizing the fleets. I'm guessing words made it to Alliance Command. Something big's headed our way. The Reapers? We don't know. Not for certain. What else could it be? If I knew that. Well, I am certain, but we should have prepared more. You know we're not ready if it is them, not by a long shot. Tell that to the Defense Committee. Unless we're planning to talk the Reapers to death, the Committee is a waste of time. They're just scared. None of them have seen what you've seen. You faced down a Reaper. Hell, you spoke to one. They blew the damn thing up. You've seen how they harvest us, what they plan to do to us. You know more about this enemy than anyone. That way they grounded me, took away my ship? You know that's not true. The shit you've done, any other soldier would have been tried, court-martialed, and discharged. It's your knowledge of the Reapers that kept that from happening. That and your good word. Yeah, I trust you, Shell. And so does the committee. I'm just a soldier, Anderson. I'm no politician. I don't need you to be either. I just need you to do whatever the hell it takes to help us stop the Reapers. They're expecting you to, Admiral. Good luck in there, Shepard. Anderson? Shepard. Caden. How'd it go in there, Major? Okay, I think. Hard to know. I'm just waiting for orders now. Major? You hadn't heard? No, I hadn't. Sorry, Shepard. It's been... <laughs> Seems to have been a bit out of touch. Spoke to him briefly, I remember, in Mass Effect 2, but wasn't much more than a few minutes, so... That's okay. Just glad I bumped into you, Caden. Yeah. Me too. Admiral. Come on. You know the commander? I used to. That could have gone better. Admiral Anderson. Shepard. What's the situation? We were hoping you would tell us. The reports coming in are unlike anything we've seen. Whole colonies have gone dark. We've lost contact with everything beyond the Soul Relay. Whatever this is, it's incomprehensibly powerful. You brought me here to confirm what you already know. The Reapers are here. Then, how do we stop them? Stop them? This isn't about strategy or tactics. This is about survival. The Reapers are more advanced than we are, more powerful, more intelligent. They don't fear us. And they'll never take pity on us. But there must be some way. We stand together, definitely. If we're going to have any chance at surviving this, we have to stand together. That's it? That's our plan? Admiral, we've lost contact with Luna Base. The moon? They couldn't be that close already. How'd they get past our defenses? Sir, UK headquarters has a visual. from Admiral Hackett. What do we do? The only
only thing we can. We fight or we die. We should get to the Normandy. Reapers is truly off to a swimming start, isn't it? Defence Committee's gone. The Reapers are all over the place, and let's I move. seriously... Yes, let's move. And I seriously doubt that there's much left of the orbital Look fleet out. at this point. How do you stop something so powerful? I'm not sure where that one came from. That last shot. Uh, stop something that powerful. Um, maybe we can throw hate balls and water balloons at it? Take a running jump. It's farther than it looks. We should have plenty of those left lying around. But I doubt this pistol's going to do much to one of those Reapers. Come on, let's go. I'm surprised, though, that all of these Reapers are sovereign types, like from the very first game. Because... Oh god, is that one heading this way? It is, isn't it? Yes, it is. Um, each Reaper is supposedly... Each Reaper is supposedly based on the species used to build it. Come on! We'll have to go this way! So they should be a wide range of appearances. Yes. There should be a wide range of appearances rather than all being this particular model. Major, you read me. I'm patching in Shepard. We're almost to the Normandy. I've got Lieutenant Vega with you. We're taking heavy fire. We're about five minutes out. 